Welcome to the Brilliance of the Seas. This is Jason here. I'm going to do a full walkthrough ship tour. You're going to love this tour. We're going to take it deck by deck. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to give you a quick preview of Deck 11. Right here is the Solarium Pool, the Solarium Bar, and Park Cafe. Right through here is the main pool area and the main pool bar. If you look up, you'll see the big screen. Straight ahead all the way to the back is the Windjammer Buffet. And take a look at this. If we go all the way to the back, there's an outside seating area. And on the other side is a bar. Let's head to the main pool area. The main pool area is right here in the center of the ship. There is plenty of deck space on either side of the main pool area. Plenty of loungers, plenty of places to relax and lie in the sun. Here in the main pool area, you're going to find a couple of whirlpools. They are going to be on the right side of the pool. Also here in the main pool area, you're going to be able to enjoy live music, DJs, and dance parties at night. Directly on the other side of the pool, opposite of the stage where you're going to listen to the live music is a pool bar. You can either sit up at the pool or you can sit right up at the bar. A deck above the pool bar is the Sky Bar, which has a comfortable lounge area. We really enjoyed coming to this bar after we got back from port. It's a really cool spot to sit, relax, have a drink, and listen to the music. Let's head on over to the Solarium Pool. This is right in front of the main pool area. It's more toward the front of the ship. This is a more relaxing area. Only adults are allowed. In the back, there is a bridge which takes you right over the pool. You'll enjoy the architecture throughout the entire area. It's beautiful. There is the glass roof which protects you from the elements so they're able to maintain the temperature which is perfect because it makes it an awesome spot to relax, enjoy the views while you're leaving port. Is what's really convenient is that here in the solarium, you're gonna find the Park Cafe. In the Park Cafe, you can enjoy many different types of snacks. In the morning, they'll serve croissants, and in the afternoon, you can grab a sandwich or a nice salad over here at the salad bar. You can also come in here and grab a complimentary coffee. Over here in the corner of the solarium is the bar. So you have Park Cafe on one side, and directly on the other side is the bar where you can grab a delicious alcoholic beverage. Let's head on into the Windjammer. This is the buffet area. It's open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. The buffet area and the garden cafe are both included in your cruise fare. Keep in mind that the Brilliance of the Seas is part of the Radiance class. There are four ships in the class. I have tours of those ships down below the description of the video and their sailings. Check those out when you have a chance. Also, if you want to book either one of those ships, make sure you give me a call. You see, is what we do is we offer you special promotional rates. It is amazing. And this is in addition to what Royal Caribbean offers you. All of our guests that call in are so happy that they did because we always give you added value to your cruise, which is amazing. When you're going on vacation, that's what you want. You want to make sure that you get the most amazing offer possible, and you can do that by giving us a call. If you look over here, you're going to find Rita's Cantina. This is all the way here at the back of the ship, right behind the buffet area. It's a Tex-Mex inspired restaurant. Also back here is the outside seating area for the Windjammer Cafe. Usually when I grab my food, I like to come back here. Let's head on up to deck 13. Right here is a bunch of deck space where you'll find loungers. You'll see the solarium right here. We're going to go past the main pool. This is Adventure Beach. This is the kids splash and pool area. And then all the way to the back is Izumi. And then right down here, you're going to see the outside seating area for the buffet area. So let's head on over here to Adventure Beach. This is the kids' splash area. There's a little blue slide that winds around that is perfect for uh, toddlers and smaller children. There's a little pool right here in the center that kids like to splash around in. On the other side of the bridge here is a half basketball court. In the middle of Adventure Beach and the basketball court is a little bridge right here which takes you right to the rock climbing wall. Keep in mind when playing on the basketball court or the rock climbing wall, you will need to use closed toed shoes. All the way on the other side of the bridge, directly across from the rock climbing wall, is the mini golf. You do not need a reservation for the mini golf. Let's head on over, grab a club, and start playing. It goes all the way around here. So as people are coming in, people are exiting. Let's go down a deck directly underneath the mini golf is Izumi. This is the sushi bar and Japanese restaurant. 
Everything here is a la carte. It is part of the specialty dining. We're gonna take a look at a few other specialty dining options when we get down to the lower decks. This is the arcade. If you want to play in the arcade, you do not need change. You just need your key card. You just swipe it and start playing. If you want your children to be able to come up here and play in the arcade, you'll need to activate their cards when you do your online check-in. This is the Viking Crown Lounge. This is on deck 13. It's all the way up at the top. Has a nice little bar right here with a comfortable lounge. This is also the nightclub. So at night, there will be a live band, dancing, parties. There's a really cool view of the main pool area from here. So it's a nice place to sit and have a drink. Let's head on down to deck six. I'm gonna give you a quick preview. Right here is the pub. Straight ahead is the casino. To the left is Vintages. Through here is Chops Grill. This is Schooner Bar. Right after that is Giovanni's Table. And through here is the Colony Club, which consists of a few different venues. So let's go ahead and take a look at the Colony Club. When you first walk in, you're gonna see the pool table. These are gyroscopic pool tables, which means they are self-leveling, which is really cool. While you're playing pool, grab a drink over here at the Jakarta Lounge, which offers posh seating and cool little stools and tables where you can relax. Over here is the lounge area, which offers live entertainment throughout the cruise. Make sure you download the app before you get on the ship. The app will tell you all of the activities and events that are taking place. All the way here in the back is a nice little lounge where you can enjoy the views in the back. This is Giovanni's Table. This is the Italian restaurant. It's a rustic style family restaurant. It's part of the specialty dining. It's right before you enter into the Colony Club. So make sure you look to the right or else you might miss it. This is Schooner Bar. Schooner Bar is a perfect late night venue for you to come and grab a drink and listen to live music. The piano player will get everybody involved and he takes requests. Sing along with all your friends and family. Right in front of Schooner Bar is Chops Grill. This is the steakhouse. Folks, Giovanni's Table and Chops Grill are also part of the specialty dining. Dining packages are available, so when you call us, make sure you ask us about them. Let's head on over to Vintages. Vintages is the wine bar. It's right here at the heart of deck six. It has a romantic social atmosphere. Posh seating and elegant couches are available on either side of the bar. There are nice views from the side right here and you can also enjoy a wine tasting. You'll need to sign up for that, so make sure you check it out on the app. Right over here is the casino. It's a full-serving casino, so you're gonna find card tables, roulette, craps. There's a bar where you can enjoy a drink there is also tournaments that are available so you can get into a Texas Hold'em tournament or a blackjack tournament. I love the atmosphere here. You'll enjoy the decorations. If you want to learn how to gamble because you don't know how, they do offer complimentary classes. Heading more toward the front of the ship, right in front of the casino is King and Country. This is the English hub. Enjoy an international pint of beer while you listen to live tunes. Usually it's gonna be a solo singer playing an acoustic. Over here in the corner is a dartboard, so bring it. After you have your pint, if you wanna catch a movie, head on over to the cinema. There aren't too many cinemas on cruise ship. It's only the Radiance Clan. Right in front of the cinema is the Pacifica Theater. Here you can enjoy awesome musicals, magic shows. Keep an eye out for the comedians when they're gonna perform because sometimes they will perform in here. Check out the late night show. They're hilarious and you'll enjoy yourself. Also in the morning, if you book an excursion with the cruise line, you will meet up here. Let's head on down to deck five. I'm gonna give you a quick preview. Right here is the art gallery. Right after that is the photo gallery. Straight through here are all the shops. Over to the left is Latitudes Cafe, next cruise. And then all the way here in the back is the main dining room. There is plenty of art on board and it is all available for purchase. Also, you can head on over to Focus if you'd like to see the pictures that the photographers took of you while you were on board the ship. Over here are all the shops. Keep in mind that they do have pretty good deals while you're on board, so make sure you check those out. Also remember that you don't pay tax on purchases while you're at sea. 
Latitudes Cafe will provide you with a delicious specialty coffee or a nice treat such as a cake, croissant, or a cookie. There's a nice little area over here that you can relax and have a seat while you enjoy your espresso. Right next to Latitudes is Next Cruise. Here you can book your Next Cruise while you're on board. If you do, they offer amazing deals. So come on in and check it out. All the way to the back here is the main dining room. It spans a couple of decks. It is 100% complimentary. It is included in your cruise fare. The main dining room is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. When you choose your dinner, you can choose either an early or a late dining, or you can do my time dining. If you do my time dining, you can come in anytime that the restaurant is open for dinner. That's usually what we like to do. Let's head on down to deck four. Deck four consists of the R bar, a stage where you'll listen to live music, the shore excursions, desk, guest services, and the entrance into the main dining room. Right here at the R bar is an excellent spot to have a drink right before dinner or during the action. This area is action packed because of the live music and the DJs that will come in for the dance parties. Keep in mind that if you're on deck five or six and you hear music, it's most likely coming from here. Over to the right is the shore excursions desk and guest services. They are both here together. Let's head on up to deck 11 and take a look at the spa and the fitness center. Let's go ahead and first take a look at the fitness center. There is a full gym. You're gonna find free weights, plenty of machines, stair masters, red mills. You can also get into many different types of classes. For example, they offer yoga classes and spin classes. Over here is the hair salon. So ladies, if you'd like to get your hair done while you're on board or get a pedicure that is available to you, over here is a sauna and a steam room. These are available in the locker room in both the men and the women. The steam room and the sauna are free in the locker room. However, if you would like a more relaxing area, you can come on in over to these relaxation suites where you can find a more formal relaxing steam room with beautiful views. There is also an aromatic steam room which has nice smells which really clears the sinuses. Thank you for joining me on the tour. This is Jason. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to get the best rate guaranteed. Give me a call. My number is right there on the screen. Have a wonderful day.